Hi, it's Paul Murphy from the Premiere Pro, and it's that time of year when I'm cleaning out my computer to make room for new jobs. So today I thought I'd show you a quick trick I use for archiving some of my projects. In this case, I'm backing up a project and I only want to hold on to the media that I've used in my sequences. Now I can easily do this using Premiere's built-in project manager, but if I go to my finder, you'll see that the result is one large folder that has no subfolders in it anymore and just one long list of media. This is fine for some projects, but there are times when I'd prefer to keep my media organized in the finder, especially if it's a project I know I'll be coming back to, or more to the point, passing on to another editor. So in this situation, I actually don't use the project manager at all. Instead, I go to my project panel and highlight all the sequences I want to back up. Then I select File, Export, Selection as Premiere Project, and this will create a new version of my project with only the assets being used by these sequences. So that's my project file archived, now I need to copy the media. For this I'm actually going to leave Premiere and open up After Effects. I'll select File, Import, Premiere Project, and open the archive project I just created. You have the option of importing all sequences or just one of them, but it's going to import all of your media, whatever you choose. If you have a lot of sequences in your project, you may want to select just one to speed up your load time. Now we can use After Effects' own project manager by selecting File, Dependencies, Collect Files. And we'll need to save this After Effects file first. Make sure Collect Source Files is set to All and click Collect. And as you can see, After Effects has recreated my bin structure as a folder structure in the Finder now. And that looks much better to me. Now normally what I would do is copy all these files onto an external drive, but before I do that I need to confirm that everything has been backed up correctly. So I'm going to open up my archive project in Premiere. I'm going to highlight everything and select File, Make Offline and click OK. Then File, Link Media. Make sure Relink Others Automatically is checked. Select any file and click Locate. Point to where you saved your archive media and click Search. When you find a match, click OK. Now Premiere seems to have found everything except for two files and I must admit I've done this on purpose to make a point about something. Those two files it wasn't able to find are from a merged clip. And the reason for this is because the media for merged clips will not import into After Effects. So it wasn't included when we were backing up our media. If you are working on a project with any merged clips, I wouldn't recommend you use this method for archiving. But everything else, multi-camera clips included, should come through without any issues. So then all that's left to do is save this project and file it away somewhere safe. And that's it, my method for backing up a project while still keeping it organized outside of the project file. I hope some of you have found this helpful for your own archiving. If you're looking for more tips and tutorials like this, check out my website, thepremierepro.com. Until next time, I'm Paul Murphy, and thanks for watching.